Hi there Google Workspace fans, it's James here from Kimberly IT. In this video I'm going to show you the most secure way of sharing a file from inside Google Drive with someone external to your business. First off go to Google Drive and then right click on the file you want to share. Click on the share option and then share again. When the share window pops up click on the cog icon in the top right hand corner and up here you want to disable this option at the moment this allows viewers and commentators to download print and make a copy of the file if they do that then they have their own copy and you've kind of lost control of the file so disable that once that's disabled go back up a level enter the email address of the person that you want to have access to the file drop their permission level down to either commentator or viewer and type in a message if you need to so here is the file once you've done that hit send that's going to go to their email inbox with a link to access the file. So what I'm going to do now is go onto my ProtonMail and show you what it looks like for the recipient to access this file. Okay, so here we are in my Proton email and you can see the email has come through with a link to access the file. When I click open, it will open in a new window but it will ask me to verify my email address and sometimes people get confused on this. So what they need to do is just hit the send button. What this does is it means that only the person who has the link should be able to access the file because once they've hit send, another email will come into their email inbox if I go back to my Proton email inbox and do a refresh. This other email has come in with a code that I need to enter. So if I copy and paste that code into this box and hit next, I'll be able to access the file. The whole point of this is so that only the person who had the original link should be able to access the file. So if they were to forward that link onto other people, they wouldn't be able to access it because they wouldn't be able to get this code. So once they've entered the code and click next, the file will open for them and they should be able to view it. And that is the most secure way of sharing a file through uh, Google Drive. 